What is up guys and welcome back. So here's a curious little video. So I found this teddy bear on the side of the road. Now this kind of thing just screams trap. Now the only difference between this one and normal traps is the normal ones you have human footprints when you use your vision. Okay, but see. after looking Let's at this little guy, there were paw prints. And that intrigued me. So walking into a trap or not, I decided to record and just see what the hell happens. So check this out. Okay, let's take a look around. So the game got a bit buggy here. It wasn't showing me the square to search that uh, stuff on the bench. So after much walking in circles, I went back to the bench and realized that was what I needed to do. So we're going to head on and follow the paw prints as well. And then you can see it's obviously a trap when you get to it. But uh, I played the entire first uh, playthrough of this game and didn't do this once. And now it's happened twice to me and I thought, fuck it, let me record it. Because this is, look at this, it's like a total setup. And you look up top, there's no ropes or anything, but uh, the animation's cool. So check what happens Ooh, afterwards. No snare, no, I walked right into that shit, damn it. Okay, I'm alive, I'm alive, good, good, good. Oh, I gotta get my gear. And I can't let him see me. So at this point, I'm wondering already why they left me with my knife. Maybe they didn't check the boot. And I love what he says when he's finished unlocking the door. Got it. So <laughs> he's telling the guy next to him, I've got it, I've unlocked it, I'm coming out to rip my fucking knife through your neck. Like so. But still, it's like some of the nests that you clear. You clear some of the, um, the infestation nests. And when you go back there after a while, he still says the same dialogue as if you haven't done it. Well, this kind of thing is probably going to be fixed over the course, but uh, still loads of fun. So the whole point of this mission now is to find your gear. Once you do, you are all back to normal. At this stage, I'm uh, trying to get my character max XP, but I've done all the storylines up to the point where... Well, I don't know, keep it spoiler free, but uh, near the ending... And if I do that, then it's going to change everything. And I'm trying to get my, my level 3 trust at Crater Lake or Diamond Encampment before I actually move forward. So I'm kind of just roaming the wastelands, discovering a whole lot of different shit. But eventually, I found my gear, which is just to my left over there in that crate, which I don't see just yet. But eventually, I grab it, and that is the end of that little encampment. So I like, I like this kind of thing. Small little side quest to do, uh, getting some XP from the kills. But yeah, pretty, pretty cool. Alright guys, that's going to bring it to the end. I hope you're enjoying the content. Smash the like button if you're loving it. And any questions you have, just ask. I'm always going to answer. So I want to say thanks for watching. And I'm going to catch you on the next one.